All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Fish and Fool Outdoors. I just walked probably about a mile, mile and a half in search of some uh, bedding peacocks, but the water clarity is absolute crap right now. I don't know what it, I don't know what it is. I don't know if the water's coming from the Everglades making it dirty or this little bit of rain we had, but my canals are absolute garbage right now. But you know what? I'm going to keep plugging away because it's a beautiful Saturday. I'm not at work. I'm out here kind of looking at this little lake right here see if I can't see anything but I'm out here again testing the, was the Cast King Ranger 5.9 of course with my lure I left the good rods at home so I could give this rod a good review and really see the longevity of this rod see if it's gonna last see if I want to buy another one because they make a couple of different lengths they make the 5.9 the 6.9 and another one but i'm not really sure how long the other one is but i might get this seven footer just for when we uh do our traveling if i'm gonna be around any salt water i like to have a seven footer or close to it to be able to zing those baits out there but anyhow i'm gonna quit rambling we're gonna head to the next spot and see if i can't find any bed and fish or any signs of life period <laughs> But right, we'll see you there. All right, well, I'm at spot number three right now, and I just seen a giant. Oh, he's right there. Big freaking male. He is lit up, too. I can't see him, though. I don't think he's protecting a bed. I don't see a female around anywhere. But it was a big freaking male. Oh, coming back. All right, we're back in business. I just had to do the quickest battery change I've ever done. I'm trying to get this freaking male right here. The dang battery died on me. It's a nice fish. Oh, here he goes, here he goes. Come on, come on. Oh, no. No. Oh, thank God. I don't want to get down there and scare this fish. I can't see. Here we go. Yes. Nice fish. Oh, we'll stay away from the rocks. Oh, baby. Come on here. <laughs> it's a little bit smaller than I thought, but still nice nonetheless. I didn't see a female. Or actually, this is a female. I didn't see a male, which is what I thought this was. Hanging around, so this one was just kind of cruising. Get it unhooked back in the water. All right, here we go. Beautiful little female. Get the release. I thought it was a male. Come all the way down here, put it right back where it was. And say goodbye, fish. Those. All right. I finally managed to catch one. It's been tough. Like I said, this water is really dirty. I just happened to see that one cruising Ooh, got one right here little little one it's cruising the shore beautiful fish come on now calm down beautiful beautiful little fish there you go just a little girl put her back Those. Got a nice bass. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. Nice. Mm -hmm. Nice bass. Good big. Peacocks right here. Here we 
go. Yes. Oh, nice peacock. Oh, nice fish. I just walked a long ways. I finally seen a nice one. That's a nice fish. Whew. It took a lot of walking and searching, but I found one. That's a nice one. Peeing on me. Let's get a picture and get it back in the water. Come on, baby. That wasn't a nice heat. Oh, wow. Oh, come on. <laughs> yes, another sweet peacock. There we go. <laughs> Thank you. Alright guys, well that's going to do it for me today. It's been a long day of walking. Well, I say long, probably about four or five hours. I'm pooped. I walked probably about four miles, four and a half, maybe five. I don't know. It seems like it's been five. But, you know, the last fish I caught were really nice. And like I said before, this is all I've been using, the Cast King travel rod. And as you can see, it's folded up and it's tiny. There's the lure, but there it is, the Cast King Ranger. I'll tell you what, I've been really happy with it lately. I mean, it handles these fish absolutely no problem. I like it though, I think I might go ahead and get the six foot nine. Just to have it for whenever I go saltwater fishing. Taking a little break right now, it's kind of hot. I just walked probably about two miles back that way. My truck spot half mile that way. I mean, you probably can't even see it. It's right there somewhere <laughs> it's way down there well like I said it was a fun day them last peacocks wore me out they took my last bit of energy but I'm gonna go ahead and drive over to Bass Pro Shop and get me a different hat a brimmed hat something where I don't have to wear this all the time because I'm starting to get as you can see I'm getting the uh, raccoon face going on because I never take my hat off <laughs> but anyways guys thanks for watching we'll see you on the next episode